Welcome to MPTV, Prayer for the Mind, Body and Soul. Hallelujah. God be glorified. Who can match up to your ways? Who is great as you are? You are a truly the Almighty God. The Savior that came and died for all sins. I worship you, God, and I give you thanks. Hallelujah. Welcome, Miss Meditation. As is our normal, we're going to go right into our listener's declaration. And I want you to repeat the prayer. Hallelujah. Let us pray as you repeat. Dear Lord, I thank you for saving me today. I also want to thank you for giving me the strength and the vigor to endure through all obstacles. Holy Spirit, live in me. Holy Spirit, welcome now and abide in my life. Be my friend. Be my joy and my comfort. Please be my leader and my guide. Dear Lord, I'm not worthy of your blessings. But I ask that you may have mercy on me. I ask that you will not pass me by today. But look upon me and forgive me of all my sins. Amen. Thank you, Lord. Can someone just give my 30-second praise? God has been good through everything you're going through. He has never left you and he has never forsaken you. He promised in his word that he will always provide for you. God has been providing for you even throughout this pandemic. He deserves all the glory and he deserves all the praise. Hallelujah. Let us pray. O Father which art in heaven, as I come to you, I thank you for all you have done in our lives. In our deepest of grief, and pains you arise and you keep us strong by the power of your glory god at this point we are deeply desperate for your love to lead us to lead us deeper in you to lead us higher in you god everyone who is listening now may they be revived May they be restored. May their spiritual life come alive. God, in our weaknesses, God, be our hope. Be our joy, O oh God. When our joy is being seared daily by the things that hurt us, O oh God, comfort us, dear Lord. Comfort us. God, forgive me of all my wrongs. Forgive us of all our wrongs. And heal our hearts back to you. Truth is, we have said some things. Truth is, we were carried away by our own lustful desires. And the pleasures of this world has blinded our eyes. Lord, we couldn't see you. And your word was is it hidden from and your word was hidden from our mouth all the days of our life around our companions. We didn't even make mention of your holy name. This morning we repent of our sins, O oh God, and we ask you for mercy. We have done some things that displeases you so bad. And you are not happy about it, oh God. Have 
Sya Naskar. We need your touch. We need your encounter. We need your peace, God, in our lives. The things that we have said, the things that we have done, the places that we have gone, the the, the people that we have surrounded ourselves with, Jesus of mercy. We need your help again. We need your strength again. I need your strength again. Save our youth. Save our youth. May our youth be hungry for you. May our youth understand your will and your plan. May salvation find every youth who has backslidden God. Bring them back to their true purpose and their true potential. Sever our youth from every, every demonic entanglement and release them, God, into great potential that will glorify your name. Jesus, may our youth arise to where you want them to be. Save our youth, God, and bring them back in your love and in your kindness. Remind them of the first love that they had with you, God, and that you still love them, no matter what. A lot of our youth has been so hurt, so abused. God, let them know that even though they were abused, mistreated, and cheated in a way that hurt them so bad, you still love them. Save, O oh youth God. Save, O oh youth God. So many of our youth God, they were, they were attending church so good. They were in worship. They were part of prayer. They were part of the youth department. And they were involved in so many activities. But they just, they just disappear subtly and we don't know where they are. They have just, they have just given up on the things containing concern in you. God, bring back our youth. Bring back our youth into your kingdom, God. May their desires be shifted. May they come back to the true potential that you have called them to perform accordingly. May their purpose never die, God. Jesus, every youth that was broken, God save them. Every youth that was abused, God save them. Oh youth, God, they're dying. They have become so attached to the environment that they're surrounded by. And so they have lost their true purpose. God Almighty, dear Father, as I come to you today, don't leave our youth out of anything that you're doing. Give them that burning desire again. Give them that love again. That love to want to worship you. That love that would want to talk about you all day long. That love that they had with you during worship at church. God, bring them back to a higher level. Don't let them be normal, God. Save our youth, God. Our youth are dying. Save our youth, O oh God. Our youth are being strayed by the simplest of things that surrounds them. By the simplest of things, they're they're just easily addicted. They're just easily attached, and then they're and then they're just swayed away in their fleshy desires. 
give our youth more of you, God. Give them an experience, God. Give them an encounter, God. Jesus, save our youth. May our youth be fully committed again. May our youth remember the first love that they have had with you and that you have never turned your back on them. You have never given up on them. Your promises are always true. You are still waiting. You are still knocking at their door. Will you allow God in your life today? Will you give him a chance today? Will you let him lead your life and take full control of you? The world has nothing to offer. God save our youth. May our youth come in true alignment with your word. Pull our youth from out of some companies, O God. Release some chains that have held them captive. God, loose them out of some situation that has held them bound. They feel as if they can't do what you want them to do. God Almighty, Jesus, I speak strength into our youth. Strength into our youth departments. Strength, God, that you will touch. Strength, God, in every youth on the corner. Let them know that marijuana is not the answer. Red Bull is not the answer. Rum is not the answer. But you are the truth, the light, and the way. God, save our youth. May our youth find true answer in you. Find true direction in you. Would you use us? Would you use me, God? Use me, God, to direct, to play the role that you want me to play in strengthening, in encouraging our youth. God Almighty, Jesus, God Almighty, have mercy on our youth. Have mercy on our youth. Have mercy on our youth. Oh God, may they be hungry again for your word. Save them, save them, God. Save them, God, from every desire that's not of you. Save them, God. Save them, God. And may they soar up with wings like eagle. May they mount up, God. Take them out of every company, cut off every relationship that they're in that is not of you, God. Bring them into a higher level with you, another level with you, God. Oh, God Almighty, show them the beauty of your love and how much you love them. Remove every darkness that is in their eyes and let them see the goodness that you have for them, the great potential that they have within them, the things that you want to do in them. Oh God, I speak to our youth right now. Don't give up on God. Don't give up on God. See, the problem is that you're giving up on God. And God has been waiting on you and you think that it's God who has given up on you. You think that you have done so much wrong and you have given up on God. And you're thinking that God hates you. But God loves you just the same. No matter what you have done. Hallelujah. Get your life right. Because God is going to do something in your life. Cut off some things. And get back into the love of God. God, I give you all the glory. And I give you all the praise. In Jesus' name. Amen.